Hi, Craig. My name's Corey. Uh, Joshua told me to send over the screencast over to you. Uh, real quick, I'm just going to shoot over three quick tips on how to actually get a, a more quality traffic to your website uh, without really any, uh, re using any ads either. Um, so the three things I'm actually going to go over is content, citations, and backlinks. I've uh, just been browsing over your uh, your website for a bit. Um, really adding a lot more content, uh, being really authoric in what you do and how you do it. Uh, just being around uh, 1,500, maybe 2,000 words um, will help you uh, uh, be, uh, uh, then also you can add in those keywords as well. So that way you can actually uh, be found for, for more keywords. Um, certain keywords to actually bring in uh, that quality traffic as well. Even these uh, images down here, this is all content. You got ND logo. Uh, you could put keywords back there. That's just going to help with your rankings even more. Now, if I go inside of Google and type in uh, air conditioning service, Ashburn VA, uh, you could do any type of a uh, uh, keyword or any location, really. Uh, but this is what you're going to see. You got ads here at the top. Um, ads, a, uh, uh, these old school ads, they got really spammy. So what Google did is came up with these Google guarantees. Uh, these are supposed to just help block out some of those spammy phone calls. Uh, just another form of paid advertisement, really. Um, they do get pretty pricey at the end of the day, and a lot of people have uh, uh, came up with ad blockers as well so um, I don't know if you're running ads I, I think you are but I don't know if you've uh, had a dip in ads over the last year uh, from running ads but I'd like to get your feedback on that uh, anyway underneath those ads we have this little map section now you got all the uh, businesses here um, trying to get ranked in this little area um, and I'll go over the numbers in just a minute and then uh, how many people actually go and search for this but uh, yeah really to get these top rankings here in this map section is going to be dealing with a, a lot of citations now uh, what a citation is just an online business directory with your business name address phone number listed on it so really what we'd want to do is go get these same citations that your top competitors have uh, we obviously don't want to stop there we want to go out there and get a lot more as well so that way we're always outranking the competition uh, maybe even 50 times or even 100 times so when Google does their algorithms um, they have no reason but to put you in these uh, these top rankings because of that uh, anyway underneath this uh, map section you got uh, this is the first page of Google and really to get the uh, uh, your your um, pages or, or your website on that on this first page really comes down to having that authoritative content uh, making sure you're found for those keywords uh, but also what comes down to what's called a backlink. Uh, what a backlink is it's a link from a website linking back to your website that's just really pushing power back to it. Uh, not all backlinks are actually created equal. Um, can I give you an example here? You got your uh, URL sticking inside of AREFs. Um, you actually have a decent uh, amount of backlinks there. Uh, good flow. Um, it looks like you got this thing going back in 2014 or so. Uh, 172 referring domains, which is pushing back over 3,000 backlinks. Historically, you've had over 12,000. Uh, you've been uh, found for uh, just about <clears throat> just over uh, 1,000, like 1 1.5 thousand keywords. Uh, the PPC stands for pay per click, so it looks like you're running a few couple ads in there. Uh, so, but total, you got about 435 clicks. This is all organically, by the way, um, without those ads. So, just from those 435 clicks, we can actually come in and see where those, uh, seeing how your website's actually being found. So these are all the keywords that you're being uh, yeah, found for. Uh, this is the amount of traffic for each keyword and also the amount of traffic that you're getting from, from the total volume. Also, it says your position that you're ranking for as well. Uh, so you have a lot of traffic to your website, but just kind of seeing what you're actually being ranked for, just kind of coming in here. Uh, gas fireplace, uh, fireplace pilot won't light. Nice home. Uh, I got your name in there. Gas fire fireplace pilot won't light. Yeah, I get that in and get in and again. Gas fireplace won't light again. You uh, can you roast marshmallows in a gas fireplace? Uh, gas fireplace not working. Emergency furnace repair near me. There's 200 clicks there. Eighth position. You're getting about seven clicks uh, to that one keyword. I'm just looking for those buyers intent keywords. Um, go to the second page here. AC repair uh, Springfield VA. There's a keyword there. Uh, there's 20 clicks for that one keyword, uh, but your fifth position, you're getting one click from that one keyword there. HVAC VA. There's 100 clicks there. 14th position, missing the traffic. Uh, need a little bit more uh, more location preference uh, on that. Um, anyway, let me show you one of your competitors here. This is a, a Walker. Um, just kind of showing you uh, these keywords here. Um, there's 
they could definitely do uh, uh, a lot more backlinking and, and drive a lot more power for these uh, keywords. But kind of giving you an example, air conditioning, Woodridge uh, VA, air conditioning service, Woodridge uh, VA. So there's uh, two different keywords there. There's 200 clicks for that one keyword. Uh, they're fifth position, so they're getting like 19 clicks. Uh, it's not a whole lot, but really coming in and finding more of these keywords. Uh, like air conditioning repair, Woodridge VA, HVAC and Woodridge VA, um, HVAC repair, Woodridge VA, furnace repair, Woodridge VA, uh, HVAC contractors, Woodridge uh, uh, VA. So really coming in and finding more of these keywords and then uh, uh, making sure you're actually getting found for them and also uh, being ranked for a good position. Uh, you're going to see a lot more quality work just come organically. Uh, then maybe you could uh, yeah, drop off some of those, uh, those, uh, those expensive ads and just go straight organic. Um, anyway, if you see any value in anything that I went over uh, and would love a custom game plan to help you get there, uh, feel free to reach back out to me. If you want to just apply these three free tips for yourself, that's fine. Uh, if you want to uh, give me a review on how I did in this video, that'd be great too. Thanks. Bye.